What's going on, everybody? So we're about to take on this dude right now in all Madden first string and uh, possibly win this Super Bowl, okay? Um, I don't. This is going to be my first Super Bowl on first string all Madden that I've won. Um, I think I've lost a couple, whatever. I, I don't know what's going on, but listen, either way, uh, this dude right here that I'm playing right here, um, you know, this is the first time that I ran into him, and this is something that still hasn't been fixed. I don't know why EA Sports continues to show people's cards because this makes people do what this guy's about to do. He's just going to leave the game, and then it doesn't count for it doesn't count for anybody. But the crazy part about it is a lot of these dudes do it, and then they wait for like a couple seconds, and then they search again, and then you run right back into them. So I don't even know what they're doing. I don't know why EA Sports hasn't fixed it to where that if they do that, it's a loss. That's something that really needs to be done because it's so annoying. It's so stupid. I get a lot of tweets about it. I understand it. I've been forwarding it, uh, forwarding it to EA Sports and letting them know that this is something that needs to be addressed because it's really stupid and you can dashboard and just get out of any game before it starts. It just doesn't make sense. Once you lock in, they should make it that anything after, you know, even, once you get to that screen, you know what I'm saying? You got if you if you quit or disconnect or whatever like that, you should get the loss. That's that's it. Doesn't matter about anything else, but Either way, we're going to get that probably taken care of very so you know, sooner than later, all right? Because I'm going to continue to voice my displeasure with that, and I need you guys to send me videos where it's still happening, and we're going to see what we can do about it. But anyway, let's go ahead and jump into the gameplay right now about the best things to do to help you win Super Bowls. All right. In the past, Madden was more of a, um, a competitive game. Three, four years ago, it was more competitive. Right now, in my opinion, it's become a little bit more friendly for everyone, including novices and guys that just don't know what's going on. Why did I run that far? Oh, okay, he made it anyway. Um, so what happens is, look, I used to love to pass the ball every play, right? And I, you could kind of think of me like Tom Brady under center back in the day with Madden because everything was more, um, I, I, I can say, realistic. Is that Because right now, right, if I wanted to pass the ball every play, let me tell you what's going to happen. Even if I have somebody beat deep, the guy's going to transport, turn into a Star, a Star Wars, or what is it, a Star Trek spaceship, and just end up right next to me and pick me off, even if I'm beating him by 10 yards. You see, things like that, it doesn't make any sense. That right there was realistic. There was no slide in action. Sean Taylor was actually right next to him and went for a swat. What I'm talking about is when you got somebody beat on the street, and the guy is, he like it's visibly like 5 to 10 yards. And they make the player slide into you. Th those type of things that go on within the passing game has really kind of, um, it's, it's really made it very annoying to be like a pass first type offense. So what I'm going to recommend you guys do, you're going to always want to make sure you establish your run game in the Super Bowl. You're going to want to make yourself as annoying as possible for your opponent. Because what, what happens is this, they, if they can't stop the run, which depending on who you play, you're going to have guys that's going to come out and run cover four drop uh, show two. Those guys have no self-respect. Um, they probably haven't taken a shower in six months, but that's neither here nor there. See, you see what I'm talking about right there? You see like how he slid into that animation? Randy Moss was visibly ahead of him and gone, but you can still slide in. And then they have a thing where when you trying to send them on a street, okay, look, you see that, like, I, I, whatever, man, I don't know what happened. Maybe I underthrew that. Maybe I underthrew it, but I thought I lobbed it uh, far, far enough. But um, those type of things that go on, it, it makes you understand how Madden has changed. So you have to be able to adapt. We can't just make, you can't keep complaining because the game is the way it is, right? So when you get to a Super Bowl, the first, you see what he's doing? Establish the run. Now, once you set the tone with the run, you, you know what I'm saying? You could do different things after that, you know, pass the ball, play action out of the same formation, stuff like that. But you're going to want to see what works. You're going to want to identify the defenses that, you, that your opponent is running. For instance, if they are running, I think I'm going to have to make a video about this, about just beating cover four, drop two, whatever. But if they come out running that, that is a very, very difficult defense if you don't know what's going on. Because what's going to happen is you're going to come out and run heavy formations, and they're going to come right in the backfield and hit you in the mouth. You're like, what the F? He's rushing nobody. Exactly, bro. Exactly. All those things are true. They are rushing nobody, and they are getting directly in the backfield. That is all true. But you're going to have to come out. You're going to have to run bunch. You're going to have to run a lot. Look at these. Yo, bro, what are these dudes diving? I don't, is diving at, I got to look on the attributes. And then this can see LaDainian Tomlinson fumbles. Look, okay. Don't use LaDainian Tomlinson. Just don't, look, I'm going to get, yo, I hate him, bro. The only way that he's good, just put him on conservative for now. But once they patch the game, like I told you guys before, once they patch the game, the conservative glitch is not going to work anymore. They're going to drop the ball. All right. Now, the one bad thing about conservative is that you can't break tackles or it's limited broken tackles or whatever like that. But it doesn't really matter because when you... Okay, strip the ball. Oh, he kicked it to me. Go, Bro, FIFA. Um, 
even though they have it with that situation where you can't break tackles, it's still very frustrating for, for you. If you're on defense and you're hit sticking them directly in the eye socket. Okay, he fumbled again. See, LT is a, yo, look, let me, oh my, yo, I'm, I'm getting a headache. I'm getting a headache. This dude, I'm not doing any more level master things, man. You know, if they continue this level master stuff. And then on top of that, they did team of the week girly. And the team of the week girly is already faster. And then they're going to do a power up. He's going to be faster than LaDainian Tomlinson already. So what was the point, bro? I guess it was just something for you to do. I don't know if they're going to make the level master thing be part of having to, um, you know, for their new sets, maybe you have to have completed that in order to complete some of the later sets. You know, like every year they have all these sets throughout the year. But I didn't get a collectible for completing level master, LaDainian Tomlinson. So I don't know if that's going to be something that's going to go on right there. He just got sticky, bro. He just got sticky. He threw a dot. Sean Taylor took the bad angle. Stuff like that's going to happen. And again, listen, with Super Bowls, don't get frustrated easily. You know, you see like how he just scored right there? I was raging uncontrollably, but I came back out. I'm going to still run the ball. I'm going to see what I can do to still slow the game down because we only need to go up seven and play good defense. We're not trying to blow anybody out in the Super Bowl because what's going to happen is dudes are going to DC glitch you when you're blowing them out, and it's going to really, really make you upset. So what you want to do is try to keep it down. You know what I'm saying? Keep the score down. Try to use up as much clock as possible and continue to run the ball as much as possible. Once you see that they're in the, like he's in the cover, cover, uh, cover four show too. I saw that he was in it and I still ran that play. I should have came out and just ran bunch and stuff like that. Like I'm about to do right now, but there's so many different ways to beat it. And you guys probably run, you know, oh my God, why did I throw it there? Why did I throw it there? The drag was wide open, man. The drags, all these different level plays, there's so many different ways to beat it. Whichever way you choose to do it, just understand that most of the people that run it, that's going to be the defense they run the entire game, no matter what you come out in, okay? So, again, bunch, four verticals, wide trips, like different things like that. Isolate it, have two drags, a drag, uh, uh, in route, over the top. Like, you're going to have to run plays that completely destroy it. But keep in mind, that if they have a beastly D-line, the game is designed to the point where you're going to get sacked if they're rushing one person. It doesn't... Why did he go for the 4 the 17? See, look, I blitz every play. So most people that play me, they got to recognize that. The only time I'm not going to blitz is when I recognize the guy is dotting me uncontrollably and there's nothing I can do about it. Obviously, I'm going to go to more coverage defenses. But once I'm, I'm in a game like this and I know I got to do certain things to, you know, keep my opponent off, you know, just, just keep him on, on his heels, bro. You know what I'm saying? Just keep him always backed up, not knowing what's going to go on. I'm going to send pressure. Pick the ball off, idiots. Pick thank you. That, why do they still have that with the ball just in the air, levitating by itself? Because I don't think Chartel is supposed to pick that. But he got it, and it is what it is. And we should be on our way to our first Super Bowl, first string. All ma- pick the ball off real quick. Okay. I was just about to say first victory, but then I threw a pick. Either way, he got five seconds left. Unless he knows a 10-point play. We're pretty much good right here. But he wants to get sacked, so that you know that works out for us. So we're going to go ahead and win this Super Bowl. And uh, you get a decent amount of those collectibles, which I'm saving for the next player, which should be released very shortly. The Amari Cooper was straight buns, and I hated him. Um, and I also, you know, I use him in the slot now. Just stay tuned. I'm going to give you guys that update. I'm going to give you my update uh, for my, my team lineup, Exposed, coming very, very soon. I want to thank all you guys and girls for the support that you've given me. Um, the sponsors that I have for live streaming on YouTube, all you guys, all the donations and everything like that that you've sent, and uh, joining me also on Twitch when I stream on that uh, on that platform as well. So you see, you get all these things, plus you get another five, so you get a decent amount for first string. All right, I'm gonna see you guys and girls next time. Good luck in your Super Bowls. One love.